what is the white man's motive for chemically feminizing the black man and masculinizing the black woman? There are actually quite a few reasons. Time today will only allow us to highlight two. Slide, please. The influential American sociologist Robert Ezra Park, co-author of a standard textbook in the field of sociology, advanced the theory that the Negro was the lady of the races. Delicate, artistic, the Negro liked to sing and dance. And too polite to hurt anyone's feelings. In contrast to the white Anglo-Saxon, who was the man of the races, strong and pioneering, Park's racial and racist sociology was only a modern version of the old colonial propaganda, according to which heterosexual masculinity was strictly the prerogative, was strictly a white prerogative in European colonies. In the European colonies, white heterosexuality, white male heterosexuality was strictly and legally the prerogative of the white colonials. Even while a homosexual imperative actually underpinned the whole colonial operation. The European colonies were homosexual playgrounds for the white man. But the white man's twisted mind, in his twisted mind, he preserved his masculinity by making the colonized men the lady of the race and the lady in the forced homosexual relationship that littered all of the white man's colonies in Africa, in the Americas, in the Isles of the Pacific. All of the white man's colonies were his homosexual playground. The colonized native cultures were feminized and the local men were unmanned in order to protect the white colonial's privilege of being the only man in town. This country never put this racist myth of the Negro as the lady of the races to rest. Instead, the scientists have gone to work to make the myth a reality, to scientifically feminize the black male so that he would present his own self to the world as indeed the lady of the races. So look at our brother, look at Mike Dick, former Chicago Bears coach, and our brother, Ricky Williams. Mike Dicker is the strong Anglo-Saxon. He's a man. And our brother, Ricky Williams, one of the best football players' tailbacks that ever played the game coming out of the University of Texas. He's the lady in the relationship. This is the psychological operation that goes along with the scientific operation. Reason two, next slide, please. 